Uh, we are at the OECD Environment Ministerial 2016 and I am with Henrik Sandstrom from Electrolux and we'd like to ask you a few questions about your business's approach to a circular economy. Uh, could you start off by saying how has your business made the operations more circular? What we have done is to look at our total value chain from a total life cycle approach. So we look at the different phases, so we look at how we manufacture stuff and we have reduced energy consumption for instance by 40% per unit in the manufacturing. We're looking at the uh, use of the appliances and we have been able to reduce energy consumption by 50% on an average and we're looking at how we can recycle material more efficiently using more recycled material into our products. We're also looking at new business models primarily on the business to business side uh, the businesses is more keen to look into the running cost of the products and make a total life cycle cost evaluation of the concept. And what are the biggest potential sources of value for, for businesses in a more circular economy? I think the value for, for businesses is to make your operations more efficient, first of all. Uh, you reduce your running cost and, and you earn more money that way. Secondly, you have a better offer to your customers and your consumers mm -hmm. by providing more efficient appliances. And thirdly, you, you meet the demand from consumers and customers when it comes to becoming more circular in your approach, like using recycled materials mm -hmm. in your products. Mm -hmm. um, what do you <laughs> think are the key barriers in going towards a more circular economy? I think the, the, the main barrier is to uh, provide a tangible thing for your consumer or the customers that he feels that he or she gets something from the business proposition and we see that it's much easier for instance for the business to business mm -hmm. to do that since they have a different way of calculating benefits mm -hmm. of, of for instance efficient products or new business models and mm -hmm. uh, what's in your view what role can the government play in, in promoting a more circular economy I think the government should be clear about their objectives. What is it they want to achieve? Is it to reduce resource consumption? Is it to reduce greenhouse gas emissions mm -hmm. and so forth? To, to make sure that you can do the right analysis. And you need to do life cycle analysis on the products assessments so you implement the correct